Hey everybody, thank you for joining us again. I'm really happy to have Marla Lawson uh, back with us for another hand. Marla, thanks for joining us again. My pleasure. So I convinced Mar us? I, I, I convinced Marla to stick around to help out with a, uh, a hand, an auction I, I struggled with today, uh, just a random hand. And then, uh, yeah, maybe we can look, look at the auction. There's a, a specific question um, about what we should do, which we faced pretty early. And I, I'd love your insight. Okay. All right, let's pull it up. Uh, so here we go. Um, we got a long club suit, uh, but a really weak hand. So let's pass. I think that's the right call. <laughs> Yay. Didn't mess up That was up an yet. easy question. <laughs> <laughs> easy question. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks, everyone, for joining us. <laughs> All right, so north opens one diamond. East opens one spade. I pass again. Yep. West has some spades too, and we get pass, pass. Uh -huh. So it's back to us, and it's up to us to pass and let them have the two spade contract, or to try to bump them up a level, or you know, perhaps even end up in a contract that who knows, maybe we could pull it off. But I didn't know if we should pass, bid our long club suit or bid uh, three diamonds, even though we just have these two not so great diamonds, but that was what partner opened. Help well, us out, the Marla. Thing I, the thing I feel very strongly about, yeah. I, have, I have a mantra, which okay. some of my partners hate, but I don't care. I do not let the opponents play at the two level if they found a fit. There's a whole mathematical explanation based on the law of toll tricks but if they have a fit somewhere, we have a fit somewhere. But regardless, okay, I'm not going to pass out and let them play two spades. That's that's like my hard line in the sand. So the question so we're is, we're not going to pass. We know what not to do. Don't pass. We're not going to pass. Okay. So we're either going to bid our less than exciting club suit, or we're going to raise partners' diamonds with only two. Now. I think, and I think we can also pretty quickly rule out the latter because partner opened a diamond. So at least in standard American and two over one, they might only have four or in some extreme cases, three. Right. So we definitely do not want to raise diamonds with only two of them. So I would close my eyes and bid three clubs. All right. It's kind of scary how weak we are and we might yeah. end up in the declare seat. You know what, though? But even if we go down, it maybe we'll only go down like one and it'll be a better score than them making two spades. Or maybe. And sometimes what? this is it's like I, I just I just pray. I click it like gritting my teeth being like, just bid again. Just all right. I want to do is get you up to the three level. <laughs> right, right. So we'll see what happens. All, all right. right. One more. Third. No. Okay. okay. Here we are. Well, at least, you know, partner's got the ace and, and two clubs for us, so that's comforting. Okay, we got right. an eight-card club fit, so. So, yeah, we got the we got the opening lead. We see partner's hand. Um, can we play through the hand, Marla? Can you, can you help us out? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, we got here, so now we got to deal with it, right? Yeah, we, we sure okay. do. Okay, well, let's start. I guess we'll pick uh, south as the master hand because definitely more trump in south. Okay. And let's count our losers. And okay. we can start with clubs. All so right. So we, we, we might have, I would say we probably have definitely one club loser and maybe two because we're missing queen jack 10. So if we're pessimistic, we'll say we have two club losers. Okay. And I see two heart losers and a diamond loser and a spade loser. Uh oh, that's a lot of losers. It's a lot of losers. <laughs> so, well, okay, let's see. What can we do about this? Um, hey, well, and real, real fast, let's you know, let's make sure the viewers um, don't uh, don't get off without having to think it through themselves. Take a moment. Feel free to pause the video. How would you plan your play? Through this hand, do you see anything you can do to try to 
get rid of one of our one or more of our potential losers. Yeah, remember there are there are three ways to get rid of a loser in a suit contract. You can rough it, you can pitch it under a long string of winners in the other hand, or you can finesse. Okay. The only I'm thing not, go ahead, yeah. It, 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 the only possibility I see is perhaps trying to get our two uh, spade winners and then try to rough the third spade, but I'm a little bit scared to. Well, they were, they bid spades. Uh, they both have, right, so they both have it. Right. But so, how, yeah. but, but. How, how would we even, how would we get to South hand to be able to that's, do it? That's the tricky part. Oh, distribution. Because the only, the only guaranteed entry to South that you have is the King of Clubs. But then you're going to have to rough with the Ace of Clubs. And that doesn't make so sense. So that, that's going to increase one of your, one of your, uh, your club losers. So we well, do. We, do we just need to? We'll win this. We just start drawing trumps. See how it breaks. Maybe it won't break as as badly as we're fearing. And take our losers where they where they fall. Anything we can do with these diamonds? Well, yeah. ten nine. We do have five of them. And Marty Bergen said, "I never met a five card suit I didn't like." So we might be able to set those up. Actually, that now that's that's a good that's a good thought. So because if we can rough out, it would take some doing. But if we could rough out um, to the king, the and queen, we, and we, the jack, and we might we might lose our 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 only if we draw trumps first, we just might not have a way to get back there because they'll probably lead another spade the next chance they get. Right. So yeah, so maybe what I would do is yeah. Well, we're gonna we're gonna win this one with either the ace or the king, and then work on diamonds immediately. All right. Just to just just to get diamonds out, and we'll we'll see what happens. Um, yeah. Low a ten. Where do I play? I'm I'm. Or, or do I go with the winner first? I'd probably I'd probably cash the ace. Okay. Maybe one of the honors will fall. Oh, that's four. Sadly, no. Okay. All right. We're going to lose this one. That's okay. All right. Then give one up. High, low. Uh, you know, I would play a low one because I'm just thinking about which ones are missing. Okay. So they might win it with the eight, but ah, ah. see, there goes ah. one of your. So the, the jack came out. Okay. So, all right, so that so. was 8, 9, 10, 11. So there's two more there. Now they, right. they are taking away our almost our last entry up there. We'll see. All, all of this might be moot. But, gosh, every hand is interesting, isn't it? That's right. Yeah, so play, play another diamond. All right. And, and rough it. And not with the two. Because, right. yeah, they might over rough. They might still over rough, but that will also... Get one at of your least, trump out. At least we forced them to over rough higher. And that's right. remembering that West's last diamond was a jack. Ah. Ah, look at that. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, we'll see if we can we can do anything with it. Now do we do two rounds of trumps and then yeah. is there anything else we can do? No, I would just, I would, you know, I, I, yeah. Oh, I would, could, could we do this? Could we? Oh, you could do that. You could, could do that. Could, yeah. Jack Spade now, yeah. rough yeah, it, yeah, and yeah. then we still have our ace and king? Oh, yeah. Let's see what happens. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, got rid of a potential loser there. Okay. So now our 10 and 9 of diamonds are both good. And... But how somebody's would we ever get gonna, back there? Somebody's probably going to rough them. But here we go. This is like the classic loser on loser thing, right? So we were going to lose those two hearts anyway. Yeah. So we might as well 
play the diamond and oh, hit your is, heart. This is pretty Even though neat. they're gonna rough it. Right, but we're getting we're getting it out. All right, let's see. Folks watching, oh, see, and there will be there will be some folks who know all the you know statistics about the right way to play this, as if there's a right way. But whatever level, other teachers too, please weigh in. How would you play this hand? All right. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying this is right. I'm just like this is what I would do. Okay. And I would do the same thing. Play you're up there, right? Play the ten. How about oh, that? That's interesting. <laughs> okay. All right. Do we ah. win this or do we go low? I maybe it doesn't matter. But already, I, I mean, this is sure to be better than letting them play in two spades. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it matters. If you, you could win it, I guess. Send it back to it them here. How about that? Yeah, was a... Wow. You, you made four. <laughs> and, uh, we did all right. Top of the heat. There you go. See? Goodness. Every hand is an adventure. Yes. That's the great thing about this game. A lot of beautiful I would say, even, like I told my students, that even if you wind up with a really bad result or you're getting a bad contract, it's like, just grin and bear it, and in seven minutes, you'll have 13 new cards and a new shot at redemption. It's fabulous. I love it. Right. And any single hand could end up being one of these uh, epics. I'll, I, I'll, I'll, I'll admit something. Um, luckily, I, 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 <laughs> I played it in a different contract, and I did not end up uh, with nearly as good a result. So, uh, Marla, <laughs> it's okay, a I lot feel of fun value. with you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Mr. That was lots of fun. Oh, well, thank you so much for joining us. And of course, uh, folks watching, thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment and uh, keep your eye out for interesting hands. Send them in. Um, maybe we can uh, rope in Marla or one of the other teachers to take a look at them sometime. That would be great. Thanks, Marla. Thanks, Bye, everyone. everyone. Bye.